<laughs> um, things are good. We just had to we just had to uh, get the producers in line. Um, you know, having your own show has been really tough and complicated thus far. Well, I, I hope the uh, help that you have hired are, are uh, doing their job. Yeah, they're they're doing okay. I mean, we don't really pay them, so we can't really expect very much from them. But you know. In, when you hi, when you hire an, wild beasts from the forest, you know it's like just it's enough that they just don't pee on everything. I wrote this song. Uh, it was like another like middle of the night adventure, and it was uh, about about MySpace stalking. Mm -hmm. But the bigger idea of like you know reminding myself about why I, I'm miserable all the time. But mm -hmm. it's such a sweet little song, and it, came, yeah. and it ended up bringing us no misery at all in recording it. I won't regret saying this, this thing that I'm saying Is it better than keeping my mouth shut? That goes without saying Fun fact about me is I actually have a six-pack. Are you serious? Yeah. Wow. I know. That's pretty impressive. Thank you. Do you do a lot of sit -ups? No, and I don't have a six-pack. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> You didn't strike me as somebody that had a six pack. But I do have a very muscular stomach, though. I was so thrilled when, like, when we finally decided that the um, that the scratched vocal and guitar version of Call It Off was going to be the thing that we were going to build from. Oh, Yeah, it does. Let's do that far off. Maybe you would have been something I'd be good at. But now, we'll never know. I won't be sad, but in case I'll go there every day. When performances like that happen and I hit the record button and they actually go down to the drive or the tape or whatever, there's this part of me that's like must guard, must protect, must con like it's yeah. just great, must not let get fucked up in any way. Mm -hmm. Like you just sort of like you put a helmet on it. I started to get a little bit afraid when we were at Kung Fu and you were like, no, I don't want it to be like pretty singer, or songwriter. singer songwriter. I said I didn't want it to be people to imagine me with long hair, a poofy vest, sitting at a coffee shop. Right, right, exactly. Yeah. And I... Been there, done that. Been there, done that. <laughs> Got a t-shirt. <laughs> if we're choosing to record to the scratch track or whatever, it's very acoustic singer songwriter and that's definitely not how I hear this song. Okay. Like when I hear the song I still hear it as quirky on all the vocals coming in and like yeah, yeah, yeah. Ted, Ted's got a really cool kind of Bruce Springsteen -y sounding guitar and stuff. Maybe Tegan you can jump in on that one first and then you can think about what you'd like to say Sarah. Okay. That's going to be a new concept. <laughs> <laughs> Is it better than keeping my mouth shut? That goes without saying. Oh, yeah. Ray. Like that. Not that. <laughs> oh. Not that. Not bad. that. Okay, maybe. <laughs> if, if she's opposed to it because it's predictable to start it on Call It Off, I don't mind us starting somewhere else. That's all I'm saying. I didn't necessarily mean like, but I thought that. I was thinking like not. But I don't. Tegan, shut the fuck. <laughs> really? Why do you want to? Why do you want to do that? With, but I thought that. Yeah. Exactly. I did start like that. And you always start like this. Anyways, leave the barking for the ocean. Okay. 
the fuck does that mean? It means you're one of those things that barks on the ocean. I just meant like, whatever notes are in that kind of pre-chorus, I meant just making a strange introduction, not necessarily playing something completely different, I just meant coming in right before the call, call it off part. Is it better than keeping my mouth shut? That goes without saying. We just like, we just go off each other. <laughs> that sounds awesome. Call MTV, <laughs> Deacon nice. and Hunter, just nice. gonna go off each other. My favorite song to work on, I think, of yours, Tegan, was Call It Off, because it involved sort of the anti-playing. The uh, concept is you tearing down your uh, drum set in rhythmic manner over yeah. the course of the song. Okay. How do you feel about that? I got two drum kits. I'm ready to go. Is it better than keeping my mouth shut? Well, it's a testament to your ego, too, that you could just totally. take apart really your drum inflated, kit rather right? than... Really inflated, rather, right? Really inflated. Rather inflated of you to, like, take your drum kit yeah. down just because I had an acoustic song that you couldn't play loud drums on. Yeah, so. the, the, the tantrum wasn't captured, and that's, yeah. the, that's the good thing. Call, break it up. Call, break my heart. Can you not be videotaping me right now? This might be the time for the new one as well. This is the time for the Christmas yeah, weird. Yeah, let's try Maybe I would have been something you'd be good at. Maybe you would have been something I'd be good at. Do you think we need to be here for your mix? Your yeah, because I want a CD. Oh, right, you want a CD. I'm yeah. sorry. You yeah. want to rush back to the house so that we can all watch TV some more? I never watched TV. Space Odyssey is still on. Never watched that television with the group. Oh, well, what are you doing upstairs? Watching Dog Whisper or whatever? No. What are you doing? I'm working on my dad's songs. I wrote a song too. Done already though. Boring. You already wrote a song and finished it? Jesus, I've been working on the same song for 900 hours. Um, I don't know. I, I was married. Like, I don't know how. I was paying attention. Do I have to separate you? No. Nope. Don't ever put your own sticks on the cup again. Well, even though we're living in a house full of a bunch of people, it seems like really only the two of us truly understand. Now this final stage is a very independent stage. It's not like the group, you know, comes together and works through this. This is really just about us now. Right. It kind of goes unspoken between Sarah and I. It's like our whole lives right now are now not getting up and making a record. It's about getting up and not losing our minds and then going and listening to what we did and, and, and saying, yes, it's right. Yes, we want it to be like that forever. You know, we don't get to come back and remix it. So this is it. And it feels like it's unspoken between us that this is the, we are united and like we have one task right now. And that task is to finish the record. Sometimes I'm not really good at expressing my feelings, but if I were to express how I feel towards you, I would get you to put your hand up like this and I would go like this and I'd be, and then you go like this. <laughs> oh, that's sweet. <laughs> the record's over. Thank God. Good luck in mastering tomorrow. Tuesday. 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 Good luck in mastering. Make it sound awesome. Or er, make it better. <laughs> that is yummy. Isn't it? I like that a lot. It's delicious. You don't need it's alcohol excellent. to taste something good. And fine. Booze doesn't make you cool. That's what I'm telling my kids. This is not even the scratch of the surface. Okay, good. So we, so we still. I mean, you're four albums into it. Fuck. Okay. I mean, you know, uh, good. Uh, I can't imagine when you're at seven and eight and nine, the, the 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 quality of the writing and the fun that you guys are gonna have making those records. Yeah. I Excellent. Because I know how you love what you do. Yes. And I know that's why you do grow because you so put in the time because you so love what you do. Yeah. yeah. That's that's the thing. That's the secret of this whole thing. That's how you grow. If you really love it, it's like any job. If you really love it, you're going to be good at it because yeah. you really can't wait to get to get to it. And I know true. that's who you guys are about this. Yeah. Well, you wouldn't have a studio in your basement <laughs> making TV shows. <laughs> yeah.
yeah. just, that just, that's just because we're nerds. 